Hi, Vazars. Uh, I just got back from the Bonn climate negotiations, the, the last round of international talks ahead of the key climate summit in Paris, just five weeks away. The most shocking thing I saw in Bonn was that while polluting countries and the fossil fuel industry send an army of, of lobbyists to maintain and protect their interests and their polluting ways, the most vulnerable countries of climate change, the people with the most to, to gain in this process, can only afford to send a handful of delegates. When you have a two week long summit with 15 meetings happening all at the same time, that means that in, in certain rooms there are empty chairs and those are chairs that could be filled by the voices of the most vulnerable, the people living with the front lines of climate change day in, day out. We know these voices matter. We've seen it before, these climate talks in the past where voices from the Maldives or the Marshall Islands or the Philippines have injected that sense of urgency, that moral clarity and helped unblock progress. For Paris, they're going to need our help. Small donations made right now, 5, 10, 15 euros, can help create a fund that will bring delegates from these vulnerable countries to Paris for the full two weeks, make sure that there are no empty chairs, that the voices of the front lines of climate change are brought in to the negotiation halls. It can also help us support a rapid response campaigns team who will help these delegates push for uh, a, a, a strong and ambitious deal that's going to take us to 100% clean energy. So please, 5, 10, 15 dollars, whatever you can, click on the link below or use the form on the right to make a small donation and let's bring the megaphone of a vase and give it to the frontline communities for the Paris talks so we can push the world on, to, on course to a deal for 100% clean energy. Thank you for your time.